Okay, welcome. Welcome to another part of the body. In the previous video, I discussed a couple of examples of the body. In this video, we're going to discuss also the body. I'm going to discuss one thing about the license that I find really important. I'm not going to discuss the whole agreement. No, no, no. I'm not going to do that. If you need explanation about the agreement, just contact us on the Discord. you find the link in the description. The link description, you press it, go to Texas channel, and there you can ask me a question about it. It's that simple. If you want this contract, you can download it. You will also find the link in the description. Simple, right? Okay. So we're going to talk about the body. And what I found really important is about the body is that you need to know what kind of things you put into the body. So like I said in the previous video, when you have a contract, you always have the contract itself. And the structure of the contract is you have an intro, you have the body, and you have the outro. In another video, I talk about the intro. You know how it looks like and what's important. In the previous video, I talk about the body and how the transition period works and where you can find the rules in a contract. And most of the time, you find it in the body. And in the next video, we'll talk about the outro. But for now, we're going to also talk about another article in the intro so you can get the general idea what I mean by this. So if you look at here, you can see here license agreement. Keep in mind when someone is transferring rights to you, most of the time you get the rights, but sometimes you get the license because they need to do more in order to give you rights. Some people, most of the time, they just give you a license to use. And the thing is, this is something you need to keep in mind. If someone creates a software, let's say this person creates a software, there is a chance that the person gave someone else a license to use and that's something you need to keep in mind so if you buy a right of someone you need to ask them hey did you give someone else the rights to use it or not because if you don't do that maybe you will approach you see someone using the software the same software and you'll be like hey but I bought the software I I have exclusive right but it isn't this person bought it maybe before you or after you and those things are really important in order for you to put in a context, especially if you talk about um, software. So let's look at the agreement. You see here, in the agreement, you see license agreement. Here, the software owner that's tried to sell you needs to promise that he didn't um, give anyone any license. You see that in here. This is some of the examples of things you can put in the contract so people cannot uh, give someone else license so only you can have exclusive right keep in mind if you want exclusive right you have to pay more for it that's something you need, really need to keep in mind so these are the things that i wanted to show you about this article i'm not going to discuss everything about it but i think this article number five is really important so just read it so if you have question about it what you can do is you can go in the discord and in the discord you have a um, channel it is called text me go there ask me question about it directly if you're new to this channel subscribe seriously subscribe it's for free and i hope you guys like this video and i will see you in the next one bye